Hi guys, this is Ashley back with another video. Before we get into the video, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure you turn on post notifications. So Lizzo has done another interview uh, where she is talking about the comments that people are saying on social media, calling her a mammy, um, you know, fat, big, whatever you want to call it on social media. Um because of you know her weight and she also released a new single with cardi b uh, called rumors um and my thing in regards to her doing all this interviewing about you know the criticism is that i could have sworn she said that she did not care okay and rumors she says she didn't care what people say all the rumors are true um on live after she finished crying, she said that, you know, she's never going to change, you know, um, and y'all not going to um, tear her down. But here she goes again doing another interview. And I'll be honest with you, it looks like, you know, she's trying to get sympathy points. Okay, because my whole thing is, Lizzo, nobody would be protected paying attention to your weight nobody would be paying attention to your weight if you just let it stick to the music okay the problem with artists they want to do all these gimmicks little nas x does it chloe bailey does it you know even cardi they want to do the gimmicks but then when people call them out or start making fun of them then they can't handle the criticism it amazes me how, you know, she went to the basketball game wearing nothing but a thong. Then, you know, her fans were saying, well, if Rihanna did it, but Rihanna didn't do it. When has Rihanna ever went to a basketball game wearing just a thong or a big t-shirt with her butt cut out? When has Rihanna ever done that? When has Beyonce ever done that? That's the issue. You're all saying, oh, well, if Rihanna did it, but Rihanna didn't do it. And Rihanna used to always show her body all the time. But when she went to um, a basketball game or any type of function where she may not want that type of attention, she wore regular clothes. <laughs> like, I don't understand it. You know, she went to the park where there were kids and she had her butt out and she was twerking. Then she got upset when people said that was inappropriate. But why would you go to a park <laughs> where there are going to be kids and have your butt out? So I don't understand. It's like, you know, she's naked all the time on Instagram. She be naked at public functions, but she don't want people to talk about her weight. Like, I don't get it. I don't understand how you can use it as a gimmick for when you want attention, but then don't want the criticism. I don't want I don't understand it. Same thing with Chloe Bailey. She don't want people to critique her or saying she's doing too much, but she's always on Instagram doing too much telling people to pre-save have mercy with no release date like i don't i never understand it <laughs> you know what i'm saying same thing with cardi cardi don't want people to talk about her looks she talk about it all the time on live but she always talking about getting surgery like i don't understand why are you guys trying to get attention and then when y'all get the attention that y'all don't like, y'all get upset. It's weird. Moving on to um, Megan Thee Stallion and Nicki Minaj. Alton John said in a recent interview that he loves Nicki Minaj and Megan Thee Stallion's music. And the barbs are going crazy saying, oh, what does that mean for Nicki Minaj? What does that mean? What does that mean? Well, I'm going to tell you. Elton John does have a lot of pull, but so does the Queen of Pop. Everybody knows who the Queen of Pop is, right? Did the Queen of Pop help Nikki? Remember, Nikki kissed her. Nikki kissed the Queen of Pop in 2018. Do you guys remember that or you guys don't remember that? 
And what happened? Nothing. Weren't they supposed to release another record? So my whole thing is just because somebody that is powerful or has a lot of pull likes an artist, that doesn't necessarily mean they will help an artist. Because it's like, well, he would have done it already. I mean, think about it. It was like, it didn't take Miley much to reach out publicly for the baby. All she did was make a statement and say, hey, you know, the baby, answer my DM. It doesn't really take much. <laughs> but yet, you know, all these artists, all these powerful people love Nikki, but never help her. I be noticing that. Beyonce, Camel Face. Kanye, all these powerful people that got a lot of pull. When the going gets tough, where are they? Drake? Y'all were saying, oh, Drake was a spy. What was he spying on? He didn't come back and tell Nikki no valuable information for her to use. So, you know, of course it looks good that Elton John likes Nikki, but a lot of people like Nikki. She's talented. She's the queen of rap, the most talented rapper of all time, the most diverse rapper of all time. Of course, everybody likes her. Even uh, the older rappers probably like Nicki Minaj, but don't want to admit it. So with that being said, it doesn't really matter unless they're willing to help. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, Elton John, that's a great look. But unless he's going to help her get some collaborations with like Dua Lipa or one of these pop stars, these big pop stars, Jesse's nice. But I, Jesse's big more in the UK. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, Little Mix, they're bigger in the UK than they are in the US. So that's a great look. But it's not a Jesse is not like an Ariana Grande or Taylor Swift. It's not a Dua Lipa, okay? Because if the record comes out, it could do well. I wouldn't say it wouldn't do well. If the record comes out, it could do well. But is it going to go straight to number one? You know what I'm saying? Like, is Republic really going to push it when they got Ariana Grande and The Weeknd? So that's how I kind of see things because, you know, you get hype, but then, you know, you see how these record labels really only push certain artists, you know, RCA. And that's just the honest truth. But anyway, like, comment and subscribe and have a great day.